Okay, I'm going to um, have a go at drafting online because I find it really useful to talk to camera my reply to the best letter about the Jerwood Gallery to date. Um, bearing in mind that I obviously expect this letter to be read by the, by the Prime Minister as he is a regular reader of the Hastings and St. Lands Observer, as you see in this photo of Dave. Um, Ridley, sorry I've forgotten Mr Ridley's first name, he's the editor, and Amber, our local MP. So, disappointing trip to Jerwood. As an, this was from Graham Pycock from West Norwood. I used to live in West Norwood, what a coincidence. As an occasional visitor to Hastings from South London, I paid a visit to the Jerwood Gallery last week. What a disappointment. I requested a guide to the gallery, but despite the £8 fee, there is none. The gallery is aimed at the connoisseur with a narrow range of contemporary and abstract art. There is no traditional portraiture or landscapes or seascapes and nothing I could find reflecting or derived from Hastings or Sussex. Sadly, there is only a limited link with local schools. This gallery ignores the town of Hastings. It is imposed upon it and the hideous building says it all. I assume the uniform black is a pretense at context in the form of the black net shops. We have much misconceived architecture in Lambeth, but nothing as malign as this. How could Hastings Borough Council have approved this plug-ugly black box? Are Hastings councillors all metro trendies themselves or just gullible? Please supply a written guide, get in some popular art, establish proper links with the community and do something, anything, to lighten the visual burden of this building. Until then I shall stick to the incomparable Dilla War Pavilion. Lovely letter. Okay, off the top of my head, here's, here's my reply. I was greatly heartened by the best critical letter of the Jerwood Gallery I've seen to date. I write as an artist, uh, though in the spirit of, oi, we're not taking your S hyphen hyphen T um, anymore. Um, some might call me a P R uh, um, asterisk asterisk S artist in Hastings and St Leonard's. Evidence of my uh, credentials um, is either on sussexcommunity.blogspot.co.uk and being a recent tweet of the week in your paper, um, but also. Um, in the Coastal Currents Guide, of which page 42 was devoted to my work. Not this year, but last. I decided not to display this year. Pending the opening of a new art gallery in February 2014, called the Hastings Pier Fire and Community Development Art Gallery. Shocked and disappointed I was, that the, co the commitment to the community of the Jerwood Gallery was so quickly reneged upon. Within three months of opening, um, on the one date that I had set to visit with, a, um, with one of my favourite local poets, Sue Coates, um, we found that the gallery was closed. Um, despite the commitment that Tuesday afternoons were free for local members, uh, for, for local residents. My attempts to prove my local residency do not fit in with the bureaucracy of the Jerwood Gallery, unaware as they are as to how bohemian some, some poorer residents of St Leonard's lives have been. At that time, I had no, um, I, I could provide no bills f in my name, nor a tenancy agreement, and was on the verge of living in a garage. Um, so, it, hopefully, I will... Um, now, as a council taxpayer, be able to prove my um, residency of Hastings and St Leonard's to the satisfaction of the Jerwood authorities. But will there be anything about 
of sufficient community development rele relevance in the gallery, such as to attract me. So far, nothing other than the architecture, which I do like uh, from the outside, has attracted me to the Joe, Joe Wood Gallery. I found the greatest piece of art uh, that co-created by the Hastings Urban Bikes Project, um, which in which I went on their cycle ride um, to the North Pole last Saturday. Simply uh, go to uh, my YouTube channel or my Twitter stream or put in the phrase Hastings Urban Bikes Ride to the North Pole, 7th of December 2013, to bring up a relevant video. This did not even cost £8, and I had both a delicious mulled wine at High Tide Cycles and a delicious uh, apple juice at um, the Admiral Bembo on London Road. More... Um, Freebies were on offer, though I declined. For £8, um, <coughs> Graham Pycock um, could have done much better than entering the Jerwood Gallery. He would have been able to buy an hour's labour from the poorer section of town to carry his bags or whatever, and come next spring, um, he wouldn't even have to pay £8. Um, he would simply to ride in the... Um, Action for Hastings Happiness um, rickshaw along the prom. So um, these are, there is much to do in Hastings of cultural and artistic importance. The Jerwood Gallery is one step removed from both this and the most important issues, such as the community development potential of the pier. From February 2014, do come to the art gallery called Hastings Pier Fire and Community Development Art Gallery. And thank you for your time. Wow, that's quite a long letter, isn't it? Help! I need help with abbreviating this. Ah!